Hi, thank you for checking out this demonstration of the Critter and Guitar Melody Mill and IIO modules for the Eurorack format. The Melody Mill is a note generation module and the IIO is a dual input speaker module. The Melody Mill has a keyboard of 16 keys made from maple. It has six synth modes, five of them are arpeggiators. It has a clock input jack, MIDI in and out jacks, and output jacks for trigger, gate, control voltage, and 5 volt square wave. The IIO has a 3 watt speaker, 2 inputs, and a volume control. The inputs are wired in parallel, so you can connect two separate sources or one single source that is played through the speaker and is also sent out to another module or device. The audio for this video will be recorded in that manner. The gray cable is going to an off-camera recorder. The first synth mode is the red single shot mode. Notes will play for as long as you hold the keys. We can use the octave button to raise the played notes up an octave. We can hold notes by playing a note or notes and then pressing the sequence button once. Press a new note or the sequence button to end the hold. To record a sequence, Press the sequence button until the red light flashes. Play a note or send a MIDI note to start the recording. To change modes, press the mode button. We are now on the yellow up arpeggiator mode. We can now utilize the rate and range controls. Let's adjust the glide or portamento between notes. Let's hold this arpeggio. And switch arpeggio modes while holding. Also playback sequences we recorded in one mode in a different mode. Let's record a new sequence. And if we adjust the range and rate to their maximums, you'll notice that the sequence length in terms of time stays the same, but the arpeggiation rate is independent of the sequence length. This means we can fit more notes into a given length of time. We can remove notes by reducing the range and rate. Sequences can be 90 seconds long or consist of 256 notes, whichever comes first. Notes and arpeggiated notes that are played live or from sequences are sent from the Melody Mill via the MIDI out jack and the 1 volt per octave control voltage jack. Let's have some fun with control voltage. Here you can see we've added the Pittsburgh Modular Synthesizer block to the mix. The IIO's input is now connected to the synth block's output. The Melody Mill's control voltage output is connected to the input on the synth block, and the same goes for the gate. This is where we can start to have a lot of fun. We could send this control voltage to any number of modules. 
back to the single shot mode. Here's a taste of how the synth block sounds. Let's turn the glide on and record a sequence. Back to the up arpeggiator mode. Let's record a new sequence. And explore some sounds from the synth block. the glide increase the LFO rate adjustment Thank you for watching. Please visit critterandguitari.com for more information.